scarf? You want to forget about the scarf, Marv? We gotta talk. We don't have the equipment to pull off anything big. You know, your banks, your jewelry stores. We don't want goods. We need cash. We need it now. How about, uh, hotels? Tourists carry lots of cash. There's no guarantees. I got a better idea. Stores ain't gonna deposit cash on Christmas Eve. The only stores that are gonna have cash on it are those that deal in moderate price goods. Right, right. Ergo, what store is gonna make the most cash on Christmas Eve that nobody's gonna think to rob? Candy stores. Nine-year-olds rob candy stores, Mom. This is what I had in mind. That's brilliant, Harry. Brilliant. <laughs> yep, there's nobody dumb enough to knock off a toy store on Christmas Eve. Oh, yes, there is. and walk out like we own the joint. Great plan, Harry. Shake his hand. Oh, well, now, thank you, and a Merry Christmas. Hello, dear family. I will. Uh, uh, let me see. Uh, you shopping alone? In New York? Sir, I'm afraid of my own shadow. Oh, I, I was just checking. That's very responsible of you. Oh, well, thank you. My pleasure. It'll be at twenty-three dollars and seventy-five cents. My, my, where did you get all that money? Uh, I have a lot of grandmothers. Oh, well, that explains it. This is a really nice store. One of the finer tour dealerships I've ever visited in my life. Oh, well, thank you. This Mr. Duncan must be a pretty nice guy. Letting all the kids come into the store and play with all his toys. Most toy stores behave at that, you know? Oh, is that so? Yep. Well, he loves kids. As a matter of fact, all the money the store takes in today, Mr. Duncan is donating it to the children's hospital. And, and, and the day after Christmas, we empty out all the money in the cash register, and Mr. Duncan just takes it right down to the hospital. That's very generous of him. Ah, oh, well, children bring him a lot of joy, as they do to everyone who appreciates them. I'm not supposed to spend this money, but I have $20 from shoveling snow in a jar in our garage where my older brother can't find it. So I can pay my mother back with that. So you can give this to Mr. Duncan. The hospital needs it more than I do. Besides, I'm probably going to spend it on stuff that will rot my teeth in my mind. <laughs> ah, that's... That's very sweet, Harry. Yeah. You see that tree there? Mm -hmm. Well, to show our appreciation for your generosity, I'm going to let you select an object from that tree that you can take home with you. Free? 
Me? Uh, uh, may, may I make a suggestion? Okay. Take the turtle doves. I could have two? Well, two turtle doves. I tell you what you do. You keep one, and you give the other one to a very special person. You see, turtle doves are a symbol of friendship and love. Now, as long as each of you have your turtle dove, You'll be friends forever. Wow, I never knew that. I thought they were just part of the song. They are. And, and, and for that very special reason. Oh. Thanks. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you, too. You should have unzipped if you go outside. It's a little nippy. Oh, maybe I'll do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Probably not.